Student Art Month is wrapping up and winding down at the Fine Arts Museum. And with that comes the presentation of awards to the participants. Artwork created by the students of Virgin Valley High School and J.L. Bowler Elementary has been showcased all month. Hundreds of pieces in all were on display. 25 local artists judged the gallery of students' works and awarded them with first, second, and third place, as well as honorable mention in the five categories. Like I said, it's tough. And uh, it's up to these professional artists to pick those top four. And then, not only pick the top four, put them in an order that one would be the one that would best represent their topic. So, it is a hard choice. Students who came through the museum were also asked to judge their fellow peers' artwork based on imitationalism, or how real the piece looked, emotionalism, if the work made you feel something, and formalism, or if the art showed a good knowledge and grasp of art concepts. Tuesday evening, the awards were revealed at a reception held at the Fine Arts Museum. The passion the art students possessed was apparent in each of the entries, from that of first grader Kylie Cannon to first place winner Maria Hernandez. And we're impressed with the artwork coming from these young kids. And they do beautiful things, and I want the community to know how good they are. So it, it's a wonderful, wonderful exhibit. To have local students' work hanging in the same gallery as professional paintings, and to have the students' work contain much of the same talent that the professional work contains, says much about the artistic flair some of these kids possess. The vision that the kids allow adults to see is, is so incredibly different. Um, because we can look at things for what they are, but the kids actually see through a lot of things. Um, and sometimes they're showing the most inner emotions. This is Samantha McBride reporting, Mesquite Local News.